Hey there YouTube, it's Math Buller. Welcome to my second of three fall Facebook purchase recap videos. In the fall of 2022, I purchased a lot of signed in-person trading cards and that's what this video is going to show. My first video showed some really quality autographed baseballs. My third video is going to show you more signed trading cards that all came from the same seller. They're very vintage so that deserves its own video. So this video has a total of 95, rotten human being right there, 95 signed trading cards, all of the in-person variety, not, okay, that's a little better, not of the uh, certified types. So first up, 10 cards for $30. We got Mitch Keller and his first Bowman, got Reese McGuire, who was part of the wonderful trade the Pirates did back in, oh, 2016 or 2018. They traded, the Pirates traded Francisco Liriano and this guy, two of their top 10 prospects to dump Liriano's salary. That's the quality of these Pittsburgh Pirates. Great. Thanks, guys. Austin Meadows in a minor league. Kevin Newman. Gift and Gope. That's a really cool one. Jose Osuna, first Bowman. Cole Tucker in a West Virginia Power. There's a black border first Bowman. And two from the ambidextrous pitcher, Pat Venditti. I, or, I'm not sure how to say his name, but we'll go with that, though. This will probably be my favorite purchase of the entire video. I paid just as much as this for those 10 cards. That's with shipping and everything. And this was totally worth it. I don't see how can beat an autographed Andrew McCutcheon first Bowman. And he even have the Bible and verse inscription too. Do not see that too often. That's cool. We got two... Vintage Pirates card at the 59 Skinner and the 60 Bob Friend there. I probably have both of these, but for five bucks each with free shipping, I'm going to add them. All right, this guy is a horrible human being um, because of what he did to Andrew McCutcheon, so he had to go in my collection. Got Vern Law's son, Vance Law, and for some reason that card was included as well. These two cards were three dollars to buck a piece, dollar shipping, and this ended up inside there too. So I thought that was kind of unusual, but okay. Got a great deal on this. Five dollars plus fifty cents sixty cents shipping, so five sixty for an autograph Rocky Blyer card. So that was neat. Twenty twenty one. Alan Ginter had him and well there we go. Got one signed. Got three seventies pirates cards here. This was ten dollars for all three dollars a piece, a buck shipping. We got the Steve Blast, which I'm sure I have this, but looks good. This is actually pretty decent looking, Bill Verdon. Now I know I don't have the Jackie Hernandez, so that's cool. That's a cool addition right there. This was an excellent, excellent deal. 22 cards for $24 total. Clint Barmas. <coughs> oh, Will Craig. Oh, he had one of the worst moments in baseball history. Elias Diaz. Ben Gamble, rookie, Richie Hebner, Chad Hermanson, Clay Holmes, first boom. Got the Art House sticker. Got another one. Joe Kel. Is that the Joe Kel? What? That's awesome. If so, Jordy Mercer. I've always liked Jordy Mercer. Shout out to Papa's Cards. Brian Morris. I already have this car. I, that was a whoops by now, and that's okay. Got the Jim Morrison. Got a Kevin Newman's. Ted Power on them sticker cards. Chris Stewart on his rookie card. He was a solid backup catcher. We got some John Wainers. The traditional and the gold. The traditional and the gold. 22 bucks shipped for all those. Thank you, Jonathan. Got four cards here for $11 total. $2.50 apiece. Dollar shipping. We got Corey Snyder. Scrap Iron Phil Gardner, who has a bunch of cards. And a couple of Vance Laws. Nice signature. I love how the L... Goes down his pant leg and ends right at the logo. It just looks so darn good. This next seller had a few cards I tried to get, but I just missed out on claiming them. But I still bought this one. 75 Grant Jackson for 375 I mean, there were some good deals to be had. Not that everything's a good deal. This was a little bit of a bummer when I saw a surface crease on here. It may have happened in the mail. We've got Teak on the 86 OP cheap and on the 88 orange border. That's cool. 
And the 79 OPC of John Candelaria. Very nice. I know I have the tops, but now I got the, can now I got the OPC from the 79 World Series year. Ten bucks total for these cards. Three bucks each. Buck to ship it. We got the Al Oliver. Al Scoop Oliver. Sangi. We got Manny Sangian. And Elroy Face on the reprint rookie there. I think that was 93 when Topps Archives did that. 95 cards to show you. Oh my goodness. This, they were $10 each, but if you bought 12, you got a pretty darn good deal. So I went ahead and got 12. Got two, Tito Francona, local guy. Nice to add him. Smokey Burgess. That's cool. This is what made me buy the cards, were these two Smokey Burgess cards. Then I just added on the Del Crandell. Really? That's neat. Really, really neat. Made such nice cards then. Jim, Mudcat inscription, Grant. Ronnie Klein, Ron Klein. I work with a co-worker. Of, I have a co-worker who's related to him. Scoop, we got Al Oliver again. Bill Verdant, dang, those 57s are so nice. Harry the Hat Walker. Manager slash outfielder, nice. So those were good pickups. Not super cheap. I had super cheap ones, and I had more expensive ones. This last one was pretty cheap. Two bucks a piece, $4 a ship. 30 cards for $64. Kyle Drabeck. We got Doug Drabeck's son. Very cool. That was the only non-pirate in here. We got some Jay Bells. I'll pay two bucks for Jay Bells because he had so many cards. First Bowman into Will Craig. It's hard not to keep buying Will Craig cards on the cheap, considering... Um, that play he had. Oh my goodness. I, I was just venting about the trade involving Francisco Liriano and two top ten pirate prospects. This is who they traded for, by the way, to dump Liriano's salary. So when you have a memorable moment like that on these minor league cards, how can you not pick up the Drew Hutchison's? Mitch Keller in an air first moment, he's got some serious potential. So I picked up some Mitch Kellers, Andy LaRoche, minor league, very cool. Got some more Kevin Newmans. Joe Rand, okay, actually this one is certified. That's not Empire, that's a certified from Signature Rookies. I think that was 94, 95. 95. Got a couple Travis Swaggerties. He'll be up with the Pirates before we know it. I don't know, we got Julian Tavares, and then we got the Cole Tuckers. So there we go. 95. Signed trading cards to show you, and it's really obvious which one's my favorite. I've already declared it, but I'll show you again. It's my man crush, Andrew McHutchin, rookie signature with the Bible verse. Dang, that's cool. I upload three videos a week, a TTM video on Monday, and an autograph and a trading card video such as this on Wednesdays and Saturdays. This was my second of three fall Facebook purchase videos. So let me know in the comments below what was your favorite. Take care, everybody.